Our top story this afternoon, it may be possible for you to vote early and avoid a long line. That sounds nice, doesn't it? Well, the Knox County Administrator of Elections is sharing ways you can get in and out more quickly. His first tip is consider all early voting options. This is why. There was still a long line at Downtown West when it closed at 6 o'clock. The same time, described the city county building voting location as very quiet. We're also told you should research the ballot ahead of time. Knox County voters specifically have two options, questions about the county charter. We're told being informed before voting can speed things along and this may surprise you. Saturdays are actually less busy than weekdays. I never would have guessed that. New at four, reporter Blake Stevens looks at why the lines are longer this year and the hard work behind keeping them moving. Early voting looks a little different in a pandemic. The lines are longer and fewer people are actually allowed inside to vote. But Chris Davis, the man in charge of Knox County elections, calls day one of early voting outstanding. He credits the work of the many poll workers. They want to vote people. They're, they're excited to be here. Uh, it's going to be a long day for them. They're going to have to put up with, you know, every once in a while you get one voter who uh, may have an issue or maybe have an, has an attitude. But most of our voters are really great. And we just encourage y'all to just thank a poll worker. You know, tell them thank you for what they do. And yesterday was a busy one for poll workers at the downtown West location as more than 1,200 people cast their ballots. You know, 1,200 people. Um, you might forget to get a voter signature. Well, they did not do that. Um, they were fantastic yesterday. It was 11 hours of verifying voters, offering help to those with mobility issues with little or no downtime. Um, the detail, we have to get every voter signature. We have to make sure we have the right voter. Um, so every person here, here, takes a lot of pride in getting that right. Davis highly recommends early voting so you can choose the location. On election day, it has to be your assigned precinct. We just want people out early voting because I don't want these folks to have to stand in longer lines and probably much longer lines on election day. He also pointed out in four of the last six election days in Knox County, the weather was not the kind you would want to be standing in line in. In Knoxville, Blake Stevens, WATE 6 on your side. Now, before you head out to vote, remember to bring your photo ID. Also remember, Knox County has moved to using paper ballots this year. You can bring your own pen or they can provide you one at the polling location.